Hey, welcome back guys. So today on this video, we're talking about your Citibank accounts and more specifically, I'm going to quickly answer a question. I keep getting a lot on my other video and that is how do you download your Citibank transaction history spreadsheet? So let's go ahead and talk about this. First off guys, real quick video, not too many steps involved. So be sure to stick around to the end of the video, but why would you want to download your transaction history for your Citibank anyway? Well, that's pretty easy. If you're running an online business, you know that sometimes your accountant or bookkeeper asks for a spreadsheet of your recent transaction. Whatever the case is, it's a pretty easy process. It's handled here in your city account. Check my video description. I'll try to leave all the written instructions there as well. But I've already opened up my city account in the city.com website. Now, in order to download your transaction history, first you have to click right here on accounts here on the top left. Okay, so once you've chosen the account, it's going to bring up the account screen for that particular account. If you have more than one, I just have one account with City. And then what you want to do is here on the right side, you want to scroll down until you see this section here called transactions. Now, in order to download a spreadsheet of your transactions on City, you need to choose the time period. So click right here. Okay, so you can download transactions for recent transactions based on statement date or last year or year to date. So for me, I'm gonna go ahead and choose year to date. Okay, next thing you wanna do is you wanna go ahead and filter these out. So let me click on filter. Okay, so now you can go ahead and choose the transaction type. So whether it's gonna be a payment, whether it was a fee, or you can leave it at all transactions like me. And then here you can go ahead and set the exact date range. So year to date, but maybe you just want the last three months, you can go ahead and set that up here. Or if you're just trying to pull a report to one particular person or a company that you paid, you can go ahead and use the search feature right here. Okay, so once you've done all of the filtering that you wanna do, you wanna go ahead and click on this blue search button. Okay, now we have all the filters on our transaction history. Now, in order to download the Citibank transaction history into a spreadsheet, you wanna click on this downward arrow right here. Okay, next you get to choose what type of file format you want. So this is really gonna depend on who's asking you for this spreadsheet. So if your accountant is working with Quicken, QuickBooks, or Open Financial Exchange, you can go ahead and download that file type. For me, I'm gonna go ahead and download a spreadsheet right here. And then you wanna click on this blue export button. Okay, now you're gonna get this pop-up confirming that your Citibank transaction history spreadsheet has been downloaded. So let me jump on over to my download folder. Okay guys, so I'm working on a Mac, so I just opened it up in the numbers app. But here you can see that the transactions are split up by status, transaction date, the description, debit or credit. So there you have it guys. If you're wondering how to download your Citibank transaction history into a spreadsheet, that's the easiest way I know how to do it. If you know an easier way, be sure to leave a comment below. Let the rest of us know how you did it. Hopefully you found that video useful. If so, click thumbs up or maybe consider subscribing to my channel and I hope to see you on the next video. Thanks again for watching.